96 kilo world team member from Mexico. Yep. Israel Silva. Uh, Israel, your new Orange Crush uh, team member out here in Corvallis, Oregon. You're freshly off of the, the season coaching uh, Chattanooga. Yes, sir. Okay, let's talk about the transition, man. What What's going to bring you out here? What is bringing you out here to Corvallis? Well, just, uh, you know, I felt I made a transition to wrestling from Mexico this year and went down there, won the Nationals, and made the world team there, competed for them. And I just needed to get in a better training situation. And I talked to Bono. Bono resigned from Chattanooga. Bono and I are uh, real good friends. And, you know, I talked to him about coming out here and training under Coach Zaleski, Troy Steiner, and Kevin Roberts. And, you know, they have a real good up-and-coming up and coming team, good guys around my weight at 197 and heavyweight. And uh, I felt this is a great training situation for me to, you know, for my wrestling and have a coaching staff to coach me. All right. So you guys had some success at Chattanooga. Bono, Bono leaves, and that brings you out here. When you, you, you officially, the family's not out here yet. When are you going to go back and get the family? I'm out here for two weeks training camp, then I'm going to California to train for another week, and then get back uh, in Chattanooga on the 26th of July. Two days later, we move everything out here and you know, be out here about August 1st for good. Any big news with your family? Uh, my wife's pregnant, seven months pregnant with uh, twin boys. Okay, and kind of a unique situation with your twin boys is you don't know if you're going to be around when they're born. No, Why is that? The due date is October 1st, but twins usually come early and... Uh, I'm leaving to go to the World Championships probably, you know, the 12th or 13th of August or of September, you know, so hopefully they don't, they don't come around that time. You know, I'll be gone for about two or three weeks in Denmark. So hopefully they either come a little bit early or late when I get back. Okay, right now uh, you're, you're 96 kilos, so 211. Uh, is, it a, is there much of a cut? You're a heavyweight in college. Uh, you told me you wrestled Mako when yeah. you're at the NCAAs. Uh, is it a cut for you to 211? No, I've, you know, I've worked really hard to get my weight down. I walk around probably about, you know, 15 to 20 pounds over at 211, and I'm pretty hydrated, so, you know, it's not a bad cut. You know, the last two or three pounds are always tough, but, you know, not a bad cut at all. Uh, how excited are you to be out here in Corvallis? I'm super excited. You know, I uh, last three years I've been kind of training with Bono, you know, both and I, both him and I were, you know, he was trained to make world team Olympic teams and, you know, we were both training at the same time, so he didn't really coach me. You know, I learned a lot from him, you know, the way he trains and, you know, he puts a lot into it, so that's what I learned from him. But, you know, I'm excited to have Coach Zaleski, Steiner, and Roberts just overlooking my training and, you know, holding me accountable and, you know, showing me new techniques and, you know, letting me take my uh, wrestling to another level out here. Okay, you've been training last pretty hard the last two days. Uh... What do you think of the, the Zaleski workouts? Do they differ from the Bono workouts? Um, no, they're all, you know, we worked hard at Chattanooga. You know, we, we work hard out here at Oregon State, but the difference is I got tough workout partners out here. You know, we got uh, Chad Hankey, who won the Filas uh, this year. The, the, the Fila opened at Vegas. He won that. And then Clayton Jack, you know, he represented the Fila juniors at heavyweight at the World Championships last year. So the workout partners are a little bit better, and, you know, and that's what made my decision, you know, to come out here is, you know, these guys are real young and they, they want to win NCAA titles out here, so I want to be part of that and help them do that.